Good afternoon, YouTubers. It's uh, currently um, Father's Day here. Um, just come back from a lovely meal with my family. Um, celebrate my dad's well Father's Day. Also, my nephew. It's his second birthday, so we've sort of a joint meal. Just come back um, and just uh, been into the tropical enclosure and had a look and just thought I'd do a video to update. Um, I had my big plant order uh, come on Monday last week. Uh, Monday or Tuesday which was my banana plants and uh, a poor poor tree and that so I've had my big order come um, so what I did then is I went to the garden centre they were having a sale on, on all the bedding plants and I bought a load of bedding plants and put them in it's basically almost complete now I've still got the heat pump to add um, in a couple of months before autumn when it starts getting cold I've got that to put in um, and I've just got to let the plants grow out a bit more and I need to get some Pentas Lanceolata for the um, for the butterflies. I've got to get a few of them. But I thought I'd show you another update just to see what you think of it. So here it is. Yeah, we just uh, just a quick one. We put this grill on here um, just for when there's any tropical birds in there. It's so that I can let the air come into the bungalow and let it circulate. Also the air vent on the side. We've got a loo vent which is shut because it's quite nippy today. Um, but basically this is the enclosure now. Uh, ponds growing, building up still. All the plants are still maturing, the fish are there. It's a river of colour now. There's the uh, elephant's ear tarot. Banana tree. and the plants are the same here's another banana here which is growing really really well can't wait till that gets to about nine foot high more bedding plants now that is the pawpaw tree a pawpaw plant what it will do it will produce uh, loads of pawpaws which I'm really looking forward to that's the poor paw. There's the heliconia again. And there's my passion flower, which has gone absolutely mad. It's absolutely doing really well. And it's going across the wall now. And hopefully we'll join up with that one over there. We put these branches in the roof as well um, for the birds. When I get my sunbirds and that, I've put branches up on the roof, suspended. I am starting to grow the passion flowers along them because I want them to be completely covered. L likewise, the uh, wood frame I'm having honeysuckle grown all the way up because I have in fact got some livestock in here um, we have in fact if I just show you we've got some broad bee hawk moth larva now they're sort of like a hummingbird um, but I don't know if you'll see don't know if you'll be able to see them because they're hiding let's have a look here just show you what you can see one I don't know whether you can see that. It's a bit blur. My camera's not very good. But that little dark line there is a broad bee. Hot moth lava. Let's see if I can find another one. There's another one there. There yeah, that's a broad bee hot moth lava. This camera's not very good, this video camera, so it's not very good at macro, so unfortunately you can't see it very well, but it's hanging up there, and that's been on the honeysuckle. And they're basically like a hummingbird when they're flying around, the moths are. They fly around from plant to plant feeding. Uh, got a lot of lantana planted in the corner. Got my Brugmansia, that's there, which I can't wait for that to grow. When that grows, that'll be fantastic. But yeah here it is all planted up there's just colour colour everywhere also you'll notice uh, now also if you wonder what these are this is rotting fruit uh, this is basically for my fruit flies um, I'm actually breeding fruit flies uh, for when the birds are in here set up two colonies I've got that colony there which is just starting off there's a fruit fly just there And I've got this colony over here, which I'm starting off as well. This is a bit more developed, the fruit's rotted, so it's absolutely covered in flies. 
All these little dots of flies running around all over it. And that's what the birds eat, they absolutely love fruit flies. And then there's the goldfish that are still swimming around. But there we go, that's my setup, that's a quick update. I just thought i will give you a quick update, show you what I've got in here, show you what's growing. And uh, I'll update again when I know a bit more or when I add a, a couple more plants. Or maybe when I get the, the tropical birds I'm going to add. But uh, have a nice day. Hope you're having a nice day. And if you're in the UK, I think uh, we only have Father's Day here on this date. So uh, happy Father's Day uh, to anyone who's uh, celebrating it. And take care. Bye-bye.